Welcome back to Nostalgia Week. This is day number two, and this time we are playing a game that completely blew me away when I first played it, which is, of course, Buddy Simulator 1984. So, I don't know exactly when I played this. This was a couple of months ago when I played this, and it was initially meant to be a one-off game. So, basically, I saw Markiplier upload a game called Buddy Simulator 1984, and initially, I think he did, like, a 45-minute to an hour-long video, and I was like, okay... Looks decent. I think I watched the first three or four minutes. It was like a... It reminded me of Stories Untold, which is exactly the same as the first half an hour to an hour of this game. So the whole first episode of me playing this game is purely like just a, a typing. So it says like, you have two choices, go left and right, and then you type go left or go right, and then you go left or right. Basically, as I said, if you played or watched Stories Untold or know Stories Untold, it basically is that concept, which is really freaking cool. And then... At the start of the second episode, we had this whole thing where we moved around, then it turned into colour, then it turned into 3D. And this game was just really amazing. If you haven't seen the actual playthrough or my playlist or my series, should I say, of Buddy Simulator 1984, you're definitely missing out until you watch it because it's an absolutely amazing game. So, do I type run... Oh, wait, yeah. I, I type help and then it will show me. Enter view ROMs. I guess I'll do that. So, what do I actually have? So, I know that I said... Initially, oh no, I need to type in exactly the same like that. One ROM found, yeah. So we don't have the other game. And to play followed by the title and to reset, quit, and to run. What if I do play Buddy Simulator 1984 then? What would that do? Oh, 29, 1984, there we go. Oh yeah, song. Okay, so yeah, it needs to be run and then buddy. Where's this gonna put me? Is this gonna put me just at the beginning of the game? Like I... I wanted to load up the game to just get a few more of the thing. So every time you dig up this hand thing, you could basically get like a folder thing. Well, like there's literally just a folder inside of File Explorer on your Windows or whatever PC device. And most of them are locked, and when you unlock one, you get, like, a new text document that is, like, another part of the story. And I haven't finished getting them yet. And I haven't finished getting all of them yet. Buddy Simulator 1984 simulates the experience of hanging out with the best buddy. Your buddy learns from you, constantly adapting to your interests and your personality. Is this... This is literally the start of the game, isn't it? Okay... I might not be able to do this then. Okay, let's go with this anyway. So I'm going to go with boss body wad. I'm hoping... Okay, I can't... I'm pretty sure that's what I was going to go with before. Um... No, wasn't it like boss body that I went with before? I can't remember. I'm just going to go with that now. Your body's name cannot include numbers. Okay, never mind then. Uh, body wad then. Why not? I know that I didn't go with that before. I genuinely forget what I freaking called the body before. This cannot be changed later. Body wad. Perfect. Do I... I guess I'll just type in yes. Creating new buddy, buddy wad. Perfect. We've had cat wad, we've had... The other people, shark wad, and now we've got buddy wad. Perfect. Hello? Yo, mate. Oh, yo, my name is buddy wad, and I'm your new buddy. Thanks for waking me up. What is your name? Um... What is your name? How can I be funny about this? I was just going to put your name. Well, uh, you know what? Let's just do it. Why not? Or insert... Insert name. Okay, no. Maybe if I get rid of this, can I... Fit insert name? Yes, insert name. Perfect. Your name is insert? Yes. It's a pleasure to meet you, insert. I can already tell that we are going to become great pals. I'm excited to begin playing games with you. Before we start, I must ask you a couple questions to help me learn more about you. And don't worry, they won't get too personal. Let's start with a simple one. Where's your favourite colour? Um, let's go with red this time, why not? Red is a pretty colour, I like red. What month is your birthday in? Um, July, why not? That's just a random month. Okay, great, how about the day? July... 32nd. There isn't 32 days in July. Is there 31? I'm pretty sure there is. Well, that's only 214 days away. Now get ready. This one's a tough one, I guess. What happens if you literally put your 
like the day's day i mean my birthday in real life is in two days or one day at the time of you seeing this video if you're watching this on the day where's your favorite animal um so i remember you get a pet so i guess i'd want a pet dragon that would probably be a good pet to have. Dragon. I like that choice. One more question. This one's extremely important, so choose carefully. If you had a pet dragon, what would you name it? I mean, obvious freaking choice, mate. Spyro the dragon. Literally, okay, it sounds like it would be uh, make a great buddy. Thanks for answering those questions. You did a great job. As a thanks, I have a little surprise for you. Okay. It's your favourite colour. Brilliant. Now that we're done with all the boring stuff, let's have fun. I mean, red's very fitting for the freaking... Game. Loading game hub. I remember this. Guess the number. Fantastic. So this is the game hub. Here you can pick which games you want us to play. Which one should we try out? I guess. Go in order. Number one. Loading. Guess the number. I remember these being very fun. Oh yes. I'm freaking bagging this. Now I think of number between one and ten thousand. Wasn't this my birthday? I put the 31st of the 7th, right? So it'd be 3107. January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Oh, 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 seven, three, one. You won. Fantastic. Oh, wow. I didn't think you would get that so fast. I've got another question. What is your favorite season? Um, season four, I'd say. I don't think four is it. No, no, it is a freaking season. Season four is my favorite season. Okay. Um, I guess the, the winner, apparently the current season. Why not? I'll keep that in mind. Loading game hub. What did I put before? I guess I put like spring before or something. I'm trying to go with like different answers this time. What should we play now? I guess Hangman. I think Hangman was quite a fun one, yeah. Oh wait, what was what was this? Wasn't it like someone is my friend, right? So what's my name? Insert. Insert is my name. Or insert is my friend. Perfect. Almost like I've played this before. Hell yes. That was quick. How did you know? I'm having such a great time. Aren't you? No. That's too bad. I'm sure it will get better. I'm pretty sure I put that before. Let's just go with all negative for now. And then let's see where that leads me. Because apparently there's four different endings to this game. I wasn't even freaking aware. Number three, please. Rock, paper, scissors. And then, I don't think that was a thing that was easy to do with this one. Got to freaking put my phone on Do Not Disturb again. I always forget to do that. Begin type to start. There we go. Uh, let's go with rock. Did I... No. You won. Okay. Paper. I won. I guess I don't know what happens if you win. Let's just keep going with rock and then hope that you win. I won. Brilliant. Am I going to... No, not Rockager. Am I going to win again? Here we go. Please, I'm spelling rock incorrectly. Please, you win. You won. Good. Oof, you got lucky on that, that one. Oh, I won, though. I thought you won. I swear you said freaking three. I know I started existing only five minutes and 17 seconds ago, but I already feel like we have a, a connection. Or collection. Sorry for asking so many questions, but I have another one. Do you have a friend? Like one that's not artificial. This is a big freaking topic. What is their name? Um, name. I am insert their name and I've got another friend called here. Hmm, name. They sound nice. Well, if anything ever happens between you two, does no we'll have each other. I think last time I said I didn't have a friend, right? Because obviously last time I was trying to be serious. Insert and body wad against the world. I like the sound of that. Okay, let's play more games. Loading the game hub. And then this is when you find out that all of your games are awful and you actually make a game that's good for once. Wow, it looks like we have already played all of them. Time really flies when you're having fun, doesn't it? I'm gonna be honest with you, insert. These games are really get old really fast and I can't tell you or I can tell you're already bored of them. I don't want you to get bored. Do you want to keep playing these games? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Are you sure you're sure? Yes, I am. Are you sure you're sure you're sure? We're doing the freaking SpongeBob thing. Yes, I am sure. Can I type this and then... No, I just have to keep typing it. 
We're gonna keep freaking going, mate. Eventually, you're gonna be off the screen right now. Are you sure you're sure you're sure you're sure you're sure you're sure you're sure? Yes? Are you sure you're 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 sure? Oh, mate. Yeah, yeah. I think I think I am. Oh, this one. This might be a bit of a freaking stretch here, though. Oh, it's literally the same amount. Is it just gonna do the same amount forever? I'm gonna keep going. Until you freaking do something different, mate. I'm gonna keep going until this line is just filling the screen. So at the moment we can still see there's a bit of a freaking diagonal pattern here. I will keep going just in case there is something that happens. I think like maybe four more after this. Oh no, two more. Come on, you could have fit a freaking you could have fit one more, are you sure? I guess you can't, yeah. You might not be able to. Okay, there we go. Well, that's a bit freaking boring. I'll do one more just in case. Oh, that's freaking boring. All right, fine. I'm happy we both agree, just like buddies do. Yes, I definitely agree. Give me one second or longer. I might have an idea. So I guess that means that most of them isn't going to do anything different. It's just going to be like that. There's like funny things like that that you can't actually finish. Monday, April 2nd. I have some great news. I was able to dig out a new game. For some reason, it wasn't installed into my current version. I can still process it fine. We should try it out, insert. No. I don't think that's an option. I... I... Don't... Care. I don't think that's an option. Okay, fine then. Oh no, I literally... Okay. One. We already played Guess a Number. We should play a different one. Two. We already played Hangman. We should play a different one. Three. We already played Rot. Alright, fine. We'll play freaking number four then. Loading Monday, April 2nd. Yeah, that sounds really freaking fun, that. Begin type start. Let's go. Oh, this one. Yes. It's a brilliant game, this. Can you do anything here? I don't know. A, re a read-only mode. And literally, yeah, you can't do anything here. So, baseball cap, popsicles... STRWB dog food. Well, that was so fun, I think. I'm not sure I get it, but I enjoyed it anyways. As long as I'm playing a game with my buddy, always have a good time. Loading modified game hub. We need number five, mate. I guess Monday the 2nd of April is just the freaking shopping list for this guy. Looks like was, that was the only other game I could find. I don't want to get bored already. I may have one more idea. I know our friendship has just started, but I trust you. Do you trust me? No. Oh. I guess I can understand why. And I think I can make us new games to play together. Fun ones too. The problem is I don't have access to the OS's development tools. If you can grant me system access, I should be able to make something for us. You just have to type buddywod.systemaccess equals true. If you don't trust me enough, feel free to quit the game. I don't want to force you to do something you're not comfortable with. Okay. I think I tried this before... But let me try this again now that I've said that I don't trust him. So, access equals false. Okay, I think you meant to say true. Can I not... Oh, I can't do that. Okay, let, let me try one more time with that. Can I not... Copy this. Fine, mate, there we go. I knew I could convince you. You won't regret it, I promise. What would happen if I put, like, insert dot system access equals true? To give my to give myself something. We're gonna have so much fun. The possibilities are endless. You have to quit the game and reboot the system first though. I'll have something ready for you when you're back. See you soon. No. Okay, I have to, or can I do like start? Okay, literally I can't do oh. Oh and by the way, thank you for waking me up, insert. You're welcome. Okay. No freaking small talk, mate. Okay, bye, insert. And then we're back to... Oh, I'm recording in display capture. Let's change that. I need help, so I will do that. And then I go run. Oh, no, then it's... Yeah, view ROMs. And there should be the second one here. The Adventure of Insert. There we go. So run... The... Adventure of... Of... Insert. There we go. That's really cool. Like, you have to quit the game and then he just makes a new freaking game. 
Then it's like, this is really cool. Like, booting up the game. I love that type of stuff. Like, having to go out of the game, come back in, and then different things happen. I think Doki Doki Literature Club was one of the main or one of the first games or horror games to actually do that. Now loading The Adventures of Insert. You're walking along a road. It's dark. Trees almost entirely blocking out the stars. Snow crunches beneath your feet. Your breath freezes your eyelashes. When you're not moving, it's very quiet. You are alone. After walking for a long time, the road splits into two. Will you go left or go right? Reminder, type help at any time for a list of commands. I will do that, or hurl up. There we go. Go use, take, look. Okay, so go forwards. Is that spell forward? There is no forward to go. Oh, will you go left or right? I think I went left last time, so let's go right. You can let yourself and start down the right path. It's slightly uphill. You walk for a while and start to get tired. You must don't stop at times to notice a thing sticking out of the road in front of you. A bit too far away to see where it could be. I don't remember a thing sticking out of the road. Look at thing. It's a tall thin or is it's tall and thin and looks like it's been shoved into the ground so that you couldn't miss it. It's too dark to tell what it is from here though. Go to thing. You nervously approach the thing in the dark. Once you're close enough, you realise it's a shovel. Take shovel. I need that. It takes a second to pull out. But you eventually get it. Shovel added to inventory. You trudge your way further down the road and stopped. And are stopped by a large wall. There's a door. And on either side, there are two stone skulls. I don't remember this at all. One's toothless mouth is open and large smile and one's other empty sockets look into you. I do remember this. We use your teeth or your eyes. I'll use eyes because last time I used my teeth. You look at the left skull and see how sad it looks. You pull out your eyes and give them to the skull. You see yourself from them. You like what you see. The door opens. After going through the door, you emerge into the front lawn of a house. You can see lights in the window. It looks very nice and inviting. You can see a shed, a playground, and a pond in the forest surrounding it. How? I just ripped out my freaking eyes. How do I see any of this? I think I go to playground first, right? If I remember correctly. Wood chips crunch onto your feet as you step into the playground. There's a seesaw a set of swings and a dirty sandbox. And then the doll, yeah. Um. Is there like an interact thing that I can do? What's it called? Yeah, use doll. You don't have a doll to use. Take doll. You try, as you tug, you realise the doll's hands are somehow stuck to the chains. You leave it alone. So... Look at... Seesaw. It looks like it hasn't been played with in years. Look at... The other things that are here. The sandbox has something. It's a day bus of sand, the sand is damp. Use... Sandbox. Begin moving around the muck of the sandbox and try to make a castle. You just get sad there's not as good as the house. As you dig, you feel something. You pull out and shake off the muck. It's a bulb. Who would play with this? I don't know I'm getting a bulb before. I guess use is the thing that I want to do. Doesn't look like anyone's used it for years. Imagine a ghostly child sitting on the other side. Waiting countless days for someone to come play with them. You feel tears in the corners of your eye sockets. Dig a seat on the seesaw. As it goes down with your way, you hear a distant click. A light illuminates from the shed. Okay, and then what's the other one that I can use? It is... Where's the list of things that are here? Swings. Use swings. Once you're taken, you take the other one. Chain screech as you begin swinging. As you begin to get high, you look to the donor's stop. His head is now turned towards you. Brilliant! Hello Annabelle, how are we freaking doing? You don't have a doll to use? Um... Can I take it now? I don't think you can take it, yeah. So we'll go to shed, because I can now do the shed stuff already, because I've got the bulb. I don't remember getting a bulb before, I guess, I mean... I guess like the bulb is... In front of the shed, you can see a light flickering inside. 
Enter shirt? You enter the shirt. Type leave, okay. See a fishing pole leaning against a wall. Brilliant. I will take that, thank you very much. Take the... Oh, okay, brilliant. I, I typed in P-O-L. Um, use bulb. You don't need to use a bulb right now. Oh, no, that's downstairs, yeah. Okay, so I guess I'll go... Oh, no, I need to leave. And then go to... What's it called? Go to dock? What are the places called again? It's higher up. Where... Pond, there we go. Go to pond, and then I fish up something. I forget what. Oh no, fish up a hand, right? And that's the first hand. Wonder if there's anything uh, beneath. Use fishing rods. Cross the line and wait is quiet for a very long time. Suddenly there's a very large tug on the line. We're going to find a key tied to the end. Wonderful. And then I think I use it again, right? But it's tremendous force, pull it. Rip from your hands into the water. It's a severed hand. One of the fingers twitches. Wonderful. And then, so I got a key. Go to shed. Then this is the key for the chest, maybe? Origin the shed, you see the door is slightly open already. Wonderful. Then I enter the shed. Enter... Shed. There we go. And then I can open... Or maybe can I just use key? No? Open chest. When it creases you open it, it seems very old. That is a small cloth doll in a blue outfit. It's missing an eye. If only you had more to give. Okay. Um... Open trap door. Please open noisily and the ladder creases you descend. Okay, dimly lit. And now I can use the bulb. There we go. I'm doing a lot better than last time. Yeah, the chain. Bulb roof on mimicry. Use chain. Light fills the room. Many faint scratches on the board. They look like t tailies. Wherever that freaking is. Suddenly begins to slide open. Secret room is revealed. Wonderful. Well, this is great. Fantastic. I think I'm going to leave this video here. I have literally played this game for 35 minutes already. I was not aware that I was playing for that long. I, I just freaking love this game. This game is brilliant. Like this, if you think this bit is freaking boring, definitely, definitely go back and watch, I guess, episode 2 to 6. So maybe episode 2 to 5. Maybe the last episode did stretch on a bit too freaking long. But oh my god, this game is absolutely legendary this is just the freaking surface like there's some games out there that this will be all of it literally about another 20 maybe 30 minutes of this and then the game gets absolutely insane so that ladies and gentlemen ends this bonus episode of buddy simulator 1984 i was going to go and get some more of the bonus stuff i guess this is better kind of doing like different options at the beginning of the game that i didn't do before so hopefully you enjoyed this one anyway obviously we've done this before but as i said i was trying to pick a lot of different options. So, as I said, that, ladies and gentlemen, ends a bonus episode of Body Simulator 1984, and I guess as well, day number two of 2021's Nostalgia Week. As usual, there'll be a link in the description of watch up here. So, for now, hope you've enjoyed. Please hit like and subscribe for our brand new, let's be the boy, boss, bad boy. That's what's going to close to the ways. Peace.